Hey, what is up guys, Adib here. Today I'm going to show you how you can get the Android P launcher. So first of all, download it and install it. And do note that if you want to get all the features working, you'll have to install it as a system app. So yeah, I have installed it as a system app. And here is the launcher itself. So the main change is that gradient has been removed. And on the search bar, you now have a button to launch the assistant. Yes. Because as we all know that with Android P, Google is going to integrate Android Assistant or the Google Assistant more with the system and that is why Google have added it to the search bar which wasn't there in the audio pixel launcher or the pixel 2 launcher which is a good thing in my opinion and other than that the launcher is pretty much the same as audio and all the features are working. As you can see, all the features are actually working. You also get the notification dots in the quick settings. And you also have the icon shape changing options, which is a good one. And yep, that is working. And guys, there is like a simple bug, which I'll, I found in this launcher in my usage, which I'll tell you in a bit. But let me just set it to the rounded square girl because that looks pretty good all right so now if you go in app drawer you'll notice that it shows the wallpaper widgets and the settings in the background of the app drawer which is a bug and it is the bug present also on the pixel and the pixel axel and other devices so yeah it's a bug of the developer preview once you get this video thumbs up and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one